Yeah. Yeah, I'm just I'm getting some uh um chicken supplies real quick. Who do we want to try first? Kale or Tainari? Oh, yeah. yeah. Let's let's do the trials first. Um <clears throat> let's do Kale first. Alright, cool. Let's do it. Kale, first impressions. That's where we have to start the video. <laughs> <laughs> I like her autos, bro. Her autos are main, dope. Main GPS Kale? No, but you know. <laughs> <laughs> running her with Zhang Ling, Lisa, and Barbara. What are they running her on? Uh, the new Dendro set? Um, yeah. After Elemental um, School, the rest of the Fallen Sargas. It's a little weird, rare desk, a weaker rare desk. That's exactly what it is. 888, stringless, 5791. Alright, fuck it. Let's uh let's give her a shot. Let's apply some elements and uh see some dendro shit, shall we? Yeah. Oh look at Bloom! Oh shit! What does that do again? What does Bloom do again? Bloom spawns the little things that explode. Oh, and that's it? Really? Yeah, and they like deal AoE damage. Wait, which one is playing? Oh my god. I should probably be doing this, like, <laughs> individually. There are yeah. there are so many reactions going on right now. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna test Aggravate. Oh my god. This one's Aggravate again? That's the... I think it's when you apply Dendro first and then Electro. Let me see. Okay, so Quicken is when you apply Dendro first and then Electro. Or no, no. Electro first and then Dendro is Quicken. My bad. And that one increases Dendro, right? Yes. And then... So that means Dendro... And then Electro. <laughs> hey, what's spread? Hmm? So, what's spread? <laughs> we should probably check the guides. Yeah. Uh, catalyze. Wow, too much was happening. I don't know what reaction is what. <laughs> Sorry. So, so quick, Quicken is Dendro on Electro. Yes. And that increases dendro damage. I think it just causes them to increase to take additional damage. Is what I'm seeing here. Is that really? Don't you have to do it twice. <laughs> Let me see. Um. All right. Electro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When when electro and dendro are out, and then you do a dendro. It's the three reaction thing. So Dendro, Electro, Dendro, increases Dendro damage. And Dendro, Electro, Electro, increases Electro damage. I think that's how it works. That sounds like how it works. Oh, let me try. Dendro. Electro. <laughs> The blue things take forever to explode. Damn, it's strong though. They do a lot of damage. You're in for a little shock. 
come a little closer. So if yeah. I do this. So quicken is like the uh the pre uh fucking reaction. Yeah. Like I would not worry about what Kali's doing. <laughs> I mean I mean Kale applies dendro like at a decent rate. I am a little concerned with how fast she's she applies dendro. It doesn't seem like very consistent. Maybe I need to try. Yeah. Her. Maybe I need to try out her ult more. I'm I'm really like trying to dive into this fucking Dendro and Electro shit. Her E has a little cooldown is too long. Yeah. See, like, okay, never mind. See, Dendro, so Dendro, Dendro and Electro. It's quicken, and the next one that's apply is what's increased. And if it's electro, it's aggravate. Yes. And aggravate is what deals more damage. More electro damage. Exactly. Now, if it's dendro and electro applied, and then dendro is the one that's caused. It's quicken. Um, it, it, no, it's spread. Oh, uh, okay. And so what's quicken? Is the one that increases dendro. Like quicken is the pre, is the pre. Uh, the first, reaction. the first reaction. Yeah. And I think it's just like an AOE explosion. Gotcha. And then if you do Dendro on top of Quicken, it's increased Dendro damage. If you do Electro on top of Quicken, it's increased Electro damage. Um, I just applied Dendro to something to see how long it, like to one of the Hilatros to see how long the Dendro stays applied for. It stays on for like seven seconds. Hmm. That's a pretty long time. Oh, is all right. Well, her, her design is amazing. You can literally make this character in fucking Soul Calibur. Like, I already know what's going on her. Bro, hold on. But the numbers I'm seeing for Aggravate are insane. Yeah. The multipliers? I wonder what the multiplier is exactly. Hold on. Isn't there like a, a guide like in-game that can tell you what the multiplier is? It doubles your damage. Ooh. I need you to die. And if you do like hydro. Electro and Dendro team. You'll have AOE, you'll have Taser. You'll have a lot. Let me try it out. So you said, let's do Hydro application. Let's apply Dendro. Right? Uh huh. And then I guess use uh, Electro two times after that. God damn! Okay, this is what pretty good. The, what did the most damage? Uh, the I like the electro stuff. Well, actually, no, the dendro stuff. Oh yeah. Yeah, I did. did call, you do, call did it, you aggravate or spread? Bro, no, I did. I just threw out three alts. <laughs> I put so I did Barbara's E that that uh, applies water on you, and then I did Kale's uh, alt and then Lisa's alt. And then I just like threw out a Kale E and it did like 13k. Mm. Which is pretty good. Because I don't think Kale has like that crazy multipliers. Okay, so when creatures are affected by Electro and Dendro, Quicken will occur, which will render them quickened. Wow. Great fucking explanation. Anyways, <laughs> when, qu when Quicken <laughs> creatures are affected by Electro or Dendro attacks, the aggravate or spread reactions will occur respectively, causing them to take additional damage. So why is it called catalyze? That's a great question. That right there is the best question that you could ask. Because it doesn't make sense for it to be called catalyze. It should just be called quickened. Yes. 
whatever. Um, okay, anyways, Bloom. If you are affected by Hydro and Dendro, the Bloom re- reaction will be triggered, creating Dendro cores. Only a certain number of Dendro cores can exist at the same time as the ones are created. Once the limit is reached, or if the duration of the existing Dendro cores ends, the pre existing Dendro cores will explode during AoE damage. So that, so techni- worth it. that technically yeah. means that you can continue to do that and just keep like, like exploding. Yeah, yep, exactly. And then if you do, if you apply pyro to the dendro cores, it causes burgeon that deals AOE dendro damage. Oh, so that's pyro, hydro, and dendro. And dendro, exactly. Damn, this is about to change the fucking game. Let's take a pogo, bro. But, deadass. <laughs> but if you do electro, it does hyper bloom that changes them into homing shots. Oh, so dendro, hydro, and electro? It, Yes, exactly. So, it looks like Dendro, Hydro, and Electro would be more useful for targets that are, like, spread out. Mm. Because that way you can apply Dendro, or Electro to the to the cores, and then they'll go out and, like, attack enemies that are in the area. Yeah, right. Whereas Pyro is just more so for, like, explosions. Dendro damage too, so if you're if you have a Dendro main DPS, then it's best to use him with uh, Hydro and Pyro. Yes. If you have like an Electro DPS or Hydro DPS, then it's best to use Bloom. Then it's best to use um, Electro and Dendro. Yeah. All right. Uh, Kali's all right. And meanwhile, yeah, what, is, what does that character do for Dendro? Kali is alright. Um, I like mm-hmm. the... You know what, let me take a look at her, like, actual... You know, let me go back into the trial, and I'm going to take a look at, like, her shit. Her mood, <laughs> yeah, word. That, yeah. I, exactly what I'm doing. Yeah. Because it looks like she... Apl- it looks like Dendro application is not going to be a problem. Yeah. Because Dendro stays applied for so long, it doesn't matter. Right. So, alright, let's see. Um, okay, so here we go. Floral Sidewinder. If one of your party members has triggered Dendro reactions before the floral ring returns, it will grant the character the sprout effect upon return. Which will continuously deal Dendro damage equivalent to 40% of Kali's attack to nearby opponents for 3 seconds. Oh. Okay. So that's more, that's also more Dendro application. Yeah. Um, and then her second passive. When a character within the, within the alt triggers Dendro stuff, the zone's duration will be increased by 1 second. And you can increase it by up to 3 seconds. Okay. So as long as you're doing shit, like, you're doing dendro reactions, then you can add three seconds to the duration, which increases it from six to, to nine. And then the cooldown is uh, 15 seconds. So there's only like a, a six second gap there. Okay. What, are her, what are her constellations on? C1 is when in the party and not on the field, Kali's energy recharge is increased by 20%. That's... Isn't that like... Who who has something like that? I think Ayato has something like that. I I don't know why Razor came to mind for that. Maybe that's in like his kit. Maybe. Bro, why C2 so long? Like what... Uh, Constellation 2, the passive talent Floral Sidewinder is changed to this. The Floral Ring will grant the character the Sprout effect from the Floral Sidewinder upon return, dealing 40... Okay, same thing. From the moment of using the Floral Brush to the moment when this instant of Sprout effect ends... What? I'm so confused. Let me see. What is the sprout effect? Is 
so it just gives you more dendro damage. The sprout effect is what deals dendro damage equivalent to 40% of Kali's attack for 3 seconds. So now, if you have C2, it extends it by another 3 seconds. It be extended this way once. Yeah, so you get 6 seconds of that that's a, a sprout. That's a very like a weird, weird passive or weird constellation. Here we go. C four using uh, Kale's ult will increase all nearby characters' elemental mastery by sixty for twelve seconds. I mean, that's all right. Sixty is sixty em really gonna make that much of a difference? I think it will. Okay. DM is hella valuable, bro. That's true. Alright, and then her C6. When the floral ring hits... What's the floral ring? Is that a... That's her E, okay. Yeah. It will create a miniature Kali Amber that will deal 200% of Kali's attack as dendro damage. Each floral brush can only create one such miniature Kali Amber. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't think you need these constellations. Yeah. You definitely don't. She's mid... Mid. Can you just call this character mid? Mid. That's offensive. Her design's cool. Her design's amazing. Her, she looks so cute. She's adorable. I'm gonna use her. Oh yeah, she's me. Hell yeah, I'm using her. Yeah. She's the first Dingo character. Let me use the fuck out of this character. Alright, cool. 